Center with the Cantor Law Group. A lot of times we get questions about a community property state. Well, Arizona is a community property state and there's 11 of them in the country. Now, what does that mean? Well, what it means is any assets you had prior to getting married are your sole and separate assets. But once you get married, anything you earn, any income and any debts become community property or community debts. So what happens is, uh, a person will have $20,000 in cash for a down payment on a house that was their sole and separate property. They buy a house. Now, at the end of the marriage, the $20,000 that was put into the house is that spouse's property. But any increase in the value plus the payments that went into the house or any debt on the house, that's community. Now, businesses, people will say, well, when I got married, my business was small. It was worth a $100,000 business, but now I'm going through a divorce. It's worth a million dollars. Well, here's what happens. Even though uh, the wife maybe never was in the office and the husband worked 20 hours a day, uh, what happens is all of that equity that was built up was due to the community working together. The wife staying home, potentially raising children, keeping the house while the husband worked. That being said, there are ways with business valuations to determine the real values. So it's not automatically 50-50 like everybody thinks. And that's where people need to contact us.